on his farm. He had a cat with a multiple personality disorder. E-I-E-I-O. With a meow bark here and a winnie moo there. Here and nay, there a rough, everywhere a cluck bag. <laughs> I'm gonna sing my part the way you guys have been singing yours. Hold on. On this one, I should have brought an extra jacket. And on this farm, he had a chicken with a really crappy attitude and a bad case of Tourette's. With the cluck you here and the cluck you there. Cluck you. You are getting worse and worse. And on this farm, he had a horse with an alternative lifestyle. E-I-E-I-O. With the hay hay here and the hay hay there. Here hay, there hay, everywhere hay hay. Hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, listen, if I, get, if I get one solid E-I-O, we can move the hell on. People. <laughs> Leaving Arnold Schwarzenegger on a roller coaster. In this case, a flume ride. Arnold Schwarzenegger on a flume ride. Here we go. <clears throat> so dumb. Oh no. At one point way back when, he was quite witty and charming. Way the hell back when. At one point way back when, he was being witty and charming to one sweet Mary Oak Blossom, who you people remember better as Zombie Number One. Oh yes, sweet Mary Oak Blossom. She was shy, beautiful, and virginal. <laughs> yeah. Well, that would take some acting. <laughs> well, one day, while being sweet and charming, Ned took her hand in his as if to kiss her dainty knuckle. But he had a cold and he sneezed. Big, gross, green slime on the chunks. Ew! <laughs> but Oak Blossom, so sweet was she, that she forgave Ned and wiped her hand on his ass. <laughs> huh? <laughs> I'm gonna hook you up, dog. <laughs> Suddenly, from across the lane, appeared Fifi. Fifi? Appeared Fifi. Fifi. Yeah, you're the only one left, genius. Over here. <laughs> over here by Bob. Fifi, over here by Bob. Fifi was a sexy French seductress. <laughs> she was tall, sort of. <laughs> she was voluptuous. <laughs> eh. <laughs> and she was rotten to the very core. Ooh. <laughs> 
was fun. Fifi, baby, you gotta try that. Stick your hand out, they'll go, ooh. 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 Holy crap, you're good. <laughs> Don't abuse the power. <laughs> when Ned saw Fifi, he went gaga. <laughs> and that's why they call him Dr. Smooth. <laughs> and he dropped poor Mary like a dirty diaper. Mary got sad. Get sad, Mary. Aww. Aww. Then she got mad. Get mad, Mary. Err. In theater, mad means hands on your hips. Facing the audience. She was hopping mad. <laughs> <laughs> well, show's over, people. <laughs> she stopped on his foot. Punched him in the stomach. Then she turned her beautiful back on him and released a mighty blast. <laughs> <laughs> now the birds are dying. <laughs> then she escaped to the safety and comfort of the backseat of Dead Bob's royal blue Toyota bus. It was parked in back, unlocked, and about six beers left over from last night's party right through that door. I don't know. I got your woman. All right, the bench. Hey, that was worth a try. <laughs> Meanwhile, Ned and Fifi eyed each other from across the lane. Ned winked at Fifi. Fifi turned up her nose, which Fifi's done before. <laughs> Ned grinned like an idiot. Perfect. <laughs> Fifi sensually wet her lips. Fifi, Fifi went home and looked up the word sensually. <laughs> Ned sensually wet his pants. I appreciate the dedication, Ned. <laughs> then Fifi did a very sexy boom boom dance to lure Ned over to her. <laughs> shake that booty when you work that booty when you shake that wake it. Why, girl? Go get some, Ned. It's your birthday. <laughs> then she did allow Ned. She allowed Ned a kiss upon her dainty cheek. Kiss her on the cheek, Ned. Wrong cheek, Ned. <laughs> then Fifi grabbed the nearby dead Bob Walker, which we haven't mentioned earlier for some strange reason. It's right there. <laughs> Oh, I knew it would fall apart. <laughs> she showed it to the audience. <laughs> and bonked Ned's brains out. <laughs> it didn't take long. Stop it, woman! <laughs> You're out of control with that thing. That's why women aren't born with bonkers. <laughs> you get excited and wear it out the first day. <laughs> Ned lay lifeless in the street. Oh, crap, Ned. You can't wait on there. It looks like hell. <laughs> Ned who the Native Americans proudly referred to as sleeps like horses, <laughs> stood there and knocked the hell out in the street. <laughs> Shut up, theater is hard. <laughs> Fifi dropped her bonker, ran over to her beloved Ned to rifle his pockets. Fifi, just get the pocket in the middle. <laughs> no, really, there's a roll of dimes in there. I can see it. <laughs> then she escaped to the zombie bench to make out with Mary Oatblossom. Yeah! They're thinking about it. <laughs> They're thinking of Ned's thinking about it. Because now he's got a roll of quarters. <laughs> Leaving poor Ned, bummed and brain dead. That's why lords and ladies, they can still be seen to this very day, kicking the dirt, grinning like a nanny at everyone he sees. The end. Yeah! Hey zombies, get on up here. Give these three zombies a huge hand! Alright, you guys go ahead and find your seats, find your seats. One more hand, damn you! Woo!